Yo, what's up, family? If you're interested in picking up Ultimate Team Coins, I got you, baby. In the description down below, footcoinking.com. Get yourself some coins. With that being said, enjoy the video, and thanks for watching. See, I waited a really long time before I made any moves in my life. Everything was a dream to me. Being a professional footballer, playing in the MLS, being a football player in general was a dream, a dream come true. And I never really, I never really pictured it being real. I didn't know if I would stay at Seattle Sounders. I didn't know if the manager wanted me here. I didn't know if the owner wanted me here. I didn't know if the people of Seattle would take me as a player. The only thing I knew is I was going to bust my ass to make sure I played for some team around the world. But finally, after days and days and hours and hours and months and months and just time of thinking and all the ups and downs in my career, I just thought to myself, it's time. I'm here. The manager told me I'm not going nowhere. The GM told me I'm staying. The owner told me I'm staying. And I decided, yo, it's time for me to make moves. My house was ghetto, man. My house was terrible. It was trash. Look at this place. Just no bueno. No one wants to live here. So I said, yo, it's time to upgrade you. Bang. Look at this shit. Hardwood floor. Big king size bed. Kitchen looking banging. I mean, look, if I brought a girl to that old house, she'd be like, come on, baby. You a football player? Now I bring a girl to this house. She's going to be like, damn, where's my ring? You got a ring? Yeah, I mean, are we getting married? <laughs> so I upgraded my house. Brand new kitchen. Brand new bedroom. Bathroom's real nice. Got the got the, the 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 boxing over there so I can work on my right hook and my left hook. Got the got the the computer so I can play my games, check Twitter, see what all the noobs are saying, see what all the all the haters are saying, see what all the lovers are saying. Got the treadmill to stay in shape, and I got a real nice plasma TV. So I got my life in order. I'm staying with the Seattle Sounders, and I'm happy about that. And I'm happy that we're in the playoffs. One thing I can say that I'm not happy about is that I'm sitting the first leg out of the playoffs. And this is very, very upsetting to me. But at the same time, I understand it. I'm actually okay with it because due to fitness, I'm out of this game. And I'd rather sit this game out and play in the second leg. Because if something bad happens in this leg, I can make up for it in the second leg when I go ham on them. <laughs> so Salt Lake, at this point, I was hoping they wouldn't find an away goal. And I was hoping wrong because they do find an away goal in like the 62nd minute. They find a goal. Now, at this point, I'm just sitting here praying like, please find a goal. Let's just end this 1-1. And we do. We find a goal. We're going to end the game 1-1, which means in the second leg, as long as we find a goal, then the away goal they scored will just cancel out. Now, we move on to this game. And in this game, and I want to say this real quick. This is the MLS Cup, but it's not actually a cup. It's the league. In, in the U.S., the way it works is you play your league, and then if you qualify for the playoffs, you go play it out for the championship. So a lot of European teams play it all through the league, and that's it, and done. You play league, whoever's on top with points wins it, but not in the MLS. you got to play playoffs. A beautiful 1-2 one th one between Skillsy and Mr. Captain America. Dempsey at the start, the game off, your boy Skillsy. Booyah. I find the away goal to cancel out their away goal, probably the biggest goal of my career. Honestly, this game is the game that puts us into the final if we win. And look at a finesse shot around the keeper into the back of the net. 1-0. Biggest goal of my career, hands down. I just want to make the final and win the MLS with Seattle Sounders. So we move on. Another great opportunity here. As you can see, I drove past one. I could have found Dempsey. I take off, and I honestly thought I was going to be able to run through that entire defense. But, man, I, I got to stop being greedy. I got to feed the needy, and Dempsey was the needy there. We move on to the 19th minute where Salt Lake was just going absolute ham, and we couldn't really get them off the ball. And when we did get them off the ball, they won it right back, and we would expect this, right? Down a goal in the game before the final, the semifinals, you would expect to be getting attacked. Now, let me say this real quick. On the other side of the, br the brackets is Philadelphia, I believe and the white caps so philadelphia and the white caps is a team that we could play and look how is that not a foul that should be a foul and a yellow card and remember keep that yellow card in mind all right he didn't get a yellow card they say he got the ball but keep that in mind because we're going to talk about that in just a minute but if we win if we go to the final i would talk too soon but if we do we're playing the white cap or philly here comes salt lake though they're trying to make that difficult for us and how does he knock that over the crossbar man we get so lucky we move on dempsey lays the ball off if he would have played me a through pass instead of shooting that, I would have been able to finish. I'm almost 100% sure. We move on to halftime up 1-0. I scored the most important goal of my career, and we're keeping a clean sheet. That is the most important thing. So we move on. 48th minute, here comes Salt Lake again doing what they do best, and that's putting pressure on us. They did it all day. They were the one causing all the danger. I mean, we would probably all oh, look at this chance. Oh, my gosh. From here, I can't tell if it hit the post or the crossbar, but I know it hit woodwork. An absolute fantastic chance for them, and thank God it went out. Over the top through past the skillsy. He's off to the races. One-on-one -on -one with a goalkeeper. 
bang. He takes me down. Now listen, first of all, that's that's one on one, which should be a red card. But it's only going to be a yellow card. Now, if we go back to that chance outside the box where I said it was a foul, and I don't know if it was a foul, but if it was a foul, should have been a yellow card. Well, that's his second. He would have had a red. He didn't hear Skillsy with a finesse shot that comes off the post, a chance to put this game away and find our second away goal. And I was just unable to do it. So you saw that, man. He could have had a red card. I think that first one was worthy of a foul. Another good shot from Skillsy. Good save by the keeper. And he, and he, and he grabs it up. So. I think the first one was worthy of a foul and a yellow card, and I think that second one was worthy. It got the foul, but I think it was worthy of a red card, to be honest with you. Great chance there from Salt Lake, and they knocked that one over. So here we go. We move on. Skillsy dribbling with it. Skillsy pull showing off his messy. Skillsy beasting and feasting. I lost the ball like a stupid little idiot. I should have finessed it. I lost the ball in a bad area. And now I just want you to watch and pay attention because if I didn't lose that ball right there, well, things would have been very different. Here comes Salt Lake. 90th minute, doing well, moving the ball. They're still on it, trying to find something, trying to do something. Someone please clear this. Please clear this. Ball into the middle. Great opportunity. Offside. Their last chance of the game, or is it their last chance? Goes into the back of the net, but he was offside. I get a jumping accomplishment there. Ref just blow the whistle. <laughs> One nil. Skills finds the biggest goal of his career to send the Seattle Sounders into the final of the MLS Cup, where we'll be taking on either Philadelphia or the Whitecap, one or the other. I am extremely excited. I, I, I don't even remember. Every time I play my players, we do well, but we don't win championships often. We have an opportunity of winning a championship in my first season. You don't want to miss it, man. If you guys enjoyed and you think it's awesome, we made a final, please smash a thumbs up. And also make sure to subscribe. Yo, skills coming up big.